welcome students here we are discussing algebra of sets and there is a very interesting law involution law in this topic algebra of sets this is very interesting that we are going to discuss here involution law and this is a double complement complement of a complement this is equal to set A itself. Let us prove it. Complement of A complement is equal to set A itself. I hope you know what is complement of a set. Let us make it clear first. Suppose universal set is having elements 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 and any set A is having even numbers 2 and 4, then its complement means A complement will be universal set minus set A. Means only those element of universal set will be here which are not available in set A. So in set A 2 and 4 these two numbers are available. So which numbers are not available in set A? 1, 3 and 5 which you will get by subtracting set A from universal set. Universal set 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and set A is having 2, 4. So if 2, 4 will be omitted from this universal set, we will get 1, 3, 5. That will be A complement. This is 1, 3, 5. Okay. So in this way, we can understand what is the A complement if universal set and set A are given, we can find A complement. And here we have to show double complement. Here we can make a conclusion by observing this example that if any element belonging to set A will not belonging to A complement. And if element is belonging to A complement, it will not belong to set A these two sets are totally disjoint sets means disjoint sets means a intersection a complement is null set no element is common so disjoint sets okay so now let us prove it here we will use a property uh, offset theory the property is if if any element x belongs to a set a implies that x is belonging to another set B, it means then set A is a subset of set B. Because by definition of subset, A is a subset of B, if all the elements of A are also available in set B. Okay? So by arbitrary, if x is arbitrary element of set A and this element x is also belonging to B, it means A is a subset of B. So this property we will be using here. And another property that we will use that if A is a subset of B and B is a subset of A, then these two sets A and B are equal. If A is a subset of B and B is a subset of A, then A is equal to set B. Okay? So let us start its proof. Let x be any arbitrary element of left hand side. So this implies that if x belonging to complement of this set, it means x will not belong to this set a complement itself. We are discussing here that if element is belonging to any set, then it will not belong to its complement. 2 and 4 are belonging to set A, set 2 and 4 are not belonging to A complement. So if X is belonging to complement of this set, X will not belong to this set. And if X is not belonging to A complement, it means X will belong to set A. So you see, here we had started with left hand side, X belonging to left hand side and we are coming here, X belonging to right hand side, X belongs to set A. What does it mean? It means therefore here left hand side is a subset of set A right hand side. This is relation number 1. 
and now conversely here we will show that RHS is a subset of LHS. So, we will take an arbitrary element of set A. So, if x is an element of set A, this implies that x will not an element of its complement. Okay? And if x is not an element of A complement, it means this implies that x belongs to complement of A complement. So, we had started with right hand side and we are coming here left hand side. So, therefore, set A is a subset of complement of A complement relation number 2. And by combining these two results, these two relations will get the result. By combining, by combining 1 and 2, we will get A complement, its whole complement is equal to set LHS is equal to RHS by using this property. If A is a subset of B and B is a subset of A, then A is equal to B. If this is a subset of A and A is a subset of this, it means this set is a equal to set A. So, very interesting, very simple proof. You, I hope you have understood it very well. So, students keep watching my videos and enjoy learning mathematics. Thank you very much.